There are many different types of books in the world. They can be fiction or non-fiction, and they can be about anything imaginable. Books are a great source of knowledge and entertainment, and they can be enjoyed by people of all ages. These are the top 5 books in the world. 5. The Odyssey. Books are often seen as a source of knowledge or entertainment, but they can also be a source of inspiration. The Odyssey is a perfect example of how a book can inspire people to be better. The story follows the main character, Odysseus, on his long journey home from the Trojan War. Along the way, he faces many challenges and overcomes them with his wit, courage, and determination. Despite the challenges he faces, he never gives up and eventually makes it home to his family. The Odyssey is a story that teaches us that no matter how difficult life may be, we should never give up on our dreams. 4. The Iliad The Iliad is a story about the Trojan War, which was fought between the Greeks and the Trojans. The Iliad is told from the perspective of the Greek hero Achilles. Achilles is one of the greatest warriors in the Greek army, and he is also the person who killed the Trojan prince Hector. The Iliad is full of action, and it is also full of the personal feelings of the characters. The Iliad is a very important work of literature, and it has been studied by many people for centuries. 3. The Mahabharata The Mahabharata is a Hindu epic that tells the story of the Kuru dynasty, as well as the battle between the Pandavas and the Kauravas. The story is full of moral lessons and values, making it a popular choice for religious and spiritual study. The Mahabharata is also one of the longest Hindu epics, consisting of 18 books. This makes it a great choice for those who want to learn more about Hinduism and its history. 2. The Quran The Quran books are the most sacred books in Islam. They are the word of God, revealed to the Prophet Muhammad, and contain the divine guidance Muslims believe is necessary for salvation. The Quran books are divided into 114 chapters, or surahs, and are further divided into verses. Muslims believe that the Quran was revealed to Muhammad over a period of 23 years and that it is the final, perfect revelation of God's will for humanity. The Quran books are the most sacred books in Islam. They are the word of God, revealed to the Prophet Muhammad, and contain the divine guidance Muslims believe is necessary for salvation. The Quran books are divided into 114 chapters, or surahs, and are further divided into verses. Muslims believe that the Quran was revealed to Muhammad over a period of 23 years and that it is the final, perfect revelation of God's will for humanity. The Quran books are the most sacred books in Islam. They are the word of God, revealed to the Prophet Muhammad, and contain the divine guidance Muslims believe is necessary for salvation. The Quran books are divided into 114 chapters, or surahs, and are further divided into verses. Muslims believe that the Quran was revealed to Muhammad over a period of 23 years and that it is the final, perfect revelation of God's will for humanity. The Quran books are the most sacred books in Islam. They are the word of God, revealed to the Prophet Muhammad, and contain the divine guidance Muslims believe is necessary for salvation. The Quran books are divided into 114 chapters, or surahs, and are further divided into verses. Muslims believe that the Quran was revealed to Muhammad over a period of 23 years and that it is the final, perfect revelation of God's will for humanity. 1. The Bible Of Joshua and Judges The Bible books of Joshua and Judges both tell the story of the Israelites' conquest of Canaan and their establishment of a new homeland. Joshua chronicles the military campaign led by Joshua himself, while Judges tells the story of the Israelites' struggle to maintain control over their new territory. The book of Joshua begins with the Israelites' crossing of the Jordan River into Canaan. Joshua then leads the Israelites in a series of military campaigns against the Canaanite tribes. The Israelites are successful in defeating these tribes and taking control of the land. The book of Judges picks up where Joshua leaves off. The Israelites are now in control of Canaan, but they are not able to maintain unity. The book tells the story of how the Israelites slowly lose control of the land as they become divided into competing tribes. Judges also tells the story of how the Israelites eventually come to be ruled by a series of foreign powers, including the Philistines and the Assyrians. While both Joshua and Judges tell the story of the Israelites' conquest of Canaan, they have different purposes. Joshua is a story of military triumph, while Judges is a story of failure. The book of Joshua shows how the Israelites were able to take control of the land, while the book of Judges shows how they were unable to maintain that control. We hope you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more content like this.